Good morning. Gonna break down a new brush for me from Frank Shaving. Very interesting brush with uh, what they call the G4 synthetic knot. And uh, I'll uh, bring this brush up to you and let you take a look. Kind of a cool handle. Rainbow with purple, red, orange, green, clear, you know, kind of interesting. But this knot, this uh, G4 Frank Shaving knot, I, I, it is so unique in the syn synthetic knot category. I've just got to tell you about this thing. Now, I'm going to do a leather lather demonstration for you and show you just uh, how well it lathers in a minute. But I want to tell you, uh, I did some testing on this. Uh, I did some testing on this all day yesterday. And this synthetic knot has the backbone of my wonderful Samog 1305 bore brush. It holds the lather like my fantastic Yaki two-band uh, badger and it has the soft tips of a silver tip badger brush but the tips are the only thing when this is wet the tips will lay over and respond like a silver tip but down below it will hold the firmness of, of my bore brush and when I lather it up it'll pack the lather in like my two band. Now I, I've never seen anything like this and yet this is a synthetic fully synthetic uh, almost zero maintenance basically you just clean it out after you're done, shake it out, hang it out to dry. There's no break-in, no conditioning, no anything with this knot, and so it's almost hard, almost hard to believe. So I'm going to, uh, I still don't have my new scuttle, but I'm going to use this little uh, mug and I'm going to take my hardest to lather. Uh, uh, it's a three mil uh, Dr. Harris Windsor soap, one of my absolute favorite soaps. But it's uh, it's no pushover to lather. So let's put this brush to the test. Now just just watch the procedure, will you? And uh, let's see if you can see what's going on here. Try to figure out how to get in here where you can see. Okay, this is good. So the point is, you see this? Those tips are very soft, but the, uh, the brush is not laying over. It's uh, got the backbone and... Uh, So I'm going to bring it on around over here and finish. Well, the view won't be as close up, but you can still see what's going on. So I'm going to bring it in here to the uh, scuttle like that. Now I'm getting serious here. And, uh, I mean, 
mean, I could really put some pressure on this. And it, and it just doesn't lay over. And the leather's just pouring off of this thing. Okay, I'm going to take it down here, do some further stir it up. Yeah, this thing is just, uh, like I say, it's just packing in that brush like a two band. And lathering like a boar. I mean, when you see this paint on my face, a little water. I mean, I don't think, I literally don't think you're going to believe it. But this thing is just cranking the lather here. Just a second, I'll bring it up and show you. Ladder's looking like lemon meringue topping. Final spin. Not bring her up here. And there you have a fully loaded brush with a very difficult to lather. Uh, Doctor, well, not really difficult. It just takes it just takes a good brush to uh, lather Dr. Harris. Now I'm going to switch the angle here. Bear with me, rather than turning the camera on. And right there should be able to get me putting this on my face to show you how this thing paints. Check her out. See this? Up. You see that? Now, if this was did not have those soft tips, it would scrape that lather off. It would scrape that lather off. But didn't have those soft tips. But look at this. And. This is going to be hard to show you, but I'm going to try. Uh, this is what I mean. Do you see how this, it stays when I lay it over? That's what a silver tip will do. But it only does that. It doesn't lay the whole brush over here. It doesn't lay the whole brush. Let me get that up and show you again. But it lays the very tops. So the very tops are are soft like a PR index 2 and the uh, but the underneath these fibers are uh, like an 8 uh, or a 9 on the PR index very uh, they don't lay over at all so this is uh, it's hard to describe but this brush is a soft painter yet it is a total lathering and scrubbing brush all all in one all in one and the feel on your face oh my it, it, uh, you would not expect it to feel like a silver tip like a silver tip badger but it does so uh, now Here's the thing. You would think a brush that has a backbone of, of a 
my best bar and it's got the soap holding ability of a two band and it's got the soft tips of a top of the line silver tip. And yet be a synthetic with a nice handle like that. You'd think this thing would be you wouldn't think this thing would be a budget brush. Nine dollars. Nine dollars shipped on Amazon.com and you can also go to frankshaving.com and get world links to Frank Shaving Brushes. This is unbelievable. I hope you'll subscribe, join my channel. Sure, be sure to comment and like. This has been Kit with DE Shape Talk with Kit.